One day, a man went to God and asked, What's the value of life? God gave him one stone and said, Find out the value of this stone, but don't sell it. The man took the stone to an orange seller and asked him what its cost would be. The orange seller saw the shiny stone and said, You can take twelve oranges and give me the stone. The man apologized and said that God has asked him not to sell it. He went ahead and found a vegetable seller. What could be the value of this stone? He asked the vegetable seller. The seller saw the shiny stone and said, Take one sack of potatoes and give me the stone. The man again apologized and said he can't sell it. Further ahead, he went into a jewelry shop and asked about the value of the stone. The jeweler saw the stone under a lens and said, I'll give you one crore for this stone. When the man shook his head, the jeweler said, All right, all right, take two crores, but give me the stone. The man explained that he can't sell the stone. Further ahead, the man saw a precious stone shop and asked the seller the value of this stone. When the precious stone seller saw the big ruby, he lay down a red cloth and put the ruby on it. Then he walked in circles around the ruby and bent down and touched his head in front of the ruby. From where did you bring this priceless ruby? He asked. Even if I sell the whole world and my life, I won't be able to purchase this priceless stone. Stunned and confused, the man returned to God and told him what had happened. Now tell me what is the value of life, God? God said, The answers you got from the orange seller, the vegetable seller, the jeweler, and the precious stone seller explain the value of our life. You may be a precious stone, even priceless, but people may value you based on their level of information, their belief in you, their motive behind entertaining you, their ambition, and their risk-taking ability. But don't fear, you will surely find someone who will discern your true value. In the eyes of God, you are very, very precious. Respect yourself and don't undermine yourself. You are unique. No one can replace you. In your life, it's all about where you place yourself. We need to be placed in the correct place to get maximum value out of our lives. You can decide if you want to be a $2 stone or a $200,000 stone. Some people love you and for whom you are everything. And some people will just use you as a commodity. For them, you will be worth nothing. No matter how costly you think you are, you will not be priced more than what the other person can afford. By that I mean, never blame anyone for taking you cheaply. So it is upon you to decide the value of your life. Your decisions and faith in yourself are what gives meaning to the life you lead. Thank you for watching. Stay blessed.